It's a crisis gripping America, leaving no state untouched. The opioid epidemic hits rural states like Missouri particularly hard. In small town Hannibal, Missouri, this is where Dr. Jennifer Allen is practicing medicine. As a family physician, she is witnessing firsthand just how fast and dangerous the opioid epidemic really is. I feel alone in Hannibal in this area. There's no one else except our clinic for two hours. Many small towns lack the resources to fight this crisis, hindering physicians' ability to treat their patients. If that would help some with her symptoms. The University of Missouri School of Medicine has developed a way to support these doctors. It's called Show Me Echo, a program that uses the tool of video conferencing. We have um, therapists, we have uh, pharmacologists, we have uh, uh, primary care doctors and physicians, and, and really I'd say as a group, um, there's a lot of expertise there. What, what advice do we have for Jenny here? Inside a secured room at Mizzou, this monitor shows doctors from across Missouri being trained by specialists to fight the opioid epidemic. Up to 20 of them can participate at one time. They enter into a learning collaborative where it's friendly, where they can ask their questions, where they can present their patients and come up with a strategy that makes sense that will really help that patient. Missouri ranks 19 in opioid overdose deaths, well over the national average, and one out of every 66 deaths in Missouri is related to opioid or heroin overdoses. And doctors understand that in order to change these troubling statistics, it will take a team approach. It's helping me to understand and say, okay, yes, we're doing things right, or no, here's something we can change or improve on. Helping communities like Hannibal fight the opioid crisis. For Innovations, I'm Kathleen Berger.